four years ago, I was approached by Masaharu Noda and uh, Alan Ime, and they were asking that I would try to, to grow some rice for them. For at that time, they said the name Shumei Natural Agriculture, which I had never heard of. Um, and our farming attitude is always looking for new things and better ways to do things. Uh, so that rang a bell. Plus the, uh, the 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 purity of spirit of Masa and Alan, it was people that I would like to deal with. Um, somebody could have offered me this potential, but if their nature wasn't such as Masa and Alan, I, I probably wouldn't have been interested. But but as it is, is it's worked out that uh, I I thoroughly enjoy the company of people that are with Shumei Natural Agriculture uh, and I, I enjoy the, the attitude that we don't need to try and modify nature. We want to just flow with it and, and we want to use what Mother Nature offers and, and it's the simplicity of it and the, in a sense, the correctness of just giving nature a chance to do what it can do fits our way. We are, we, we've been evolving over time to doing less and less inputs anyway on, on our crops. So this is a natural culmination of, of the way my son and I think, it's taken to a higher level. When we started on this, I expected it to probably not work. Um, you know, growing crops without fertilizer, no one does. Uh, and so it was a new venture and now I feel pretty, I feel confident that, that we, can, we can do it well and, and that actually the markets can grow and that we can do more crops in time. Yeah, it's, so it's a move from doubt to uh, somewhat certainty that we can pull this off. By not using the fertilizers, we are having a, a more pure product and, and, and also, you know, we, our crew we're a happy, positive group, uh, both my son and I on the farming, and we see the fields every day, but we also make a point because we are farming so many acres that our, our, our crews around the crops is much or more than we are. And, and I think it helps that, that everyone feels good about what they're doing, that there's a positive atmosphere, and the positive atmosphere gets, gets passed on to, to the plants and the growth of the plants. And, so I think it's a combination of, of what Shume puts its values in. It puts its values in saving the seed, which we're doing. It puts its value in the spiritual connection of the farmers. And that's certainly true on our part, you know, and, and the purity of the soil that can occur that you don't need to inundate it with a bunch of external inputs. Cover crops and from our end, a crop rotation is, is advantageous to producing uh, the best quality that we can. We've been growing Akita for four years, Akita Kamachi, and we've been growing Jasmine. This is the second year. I think I'm standing close to the split. Akita is to this side and Jasmine's to this side. Um, they grew side by side last year also. The, uh, the seed has been saved from years past. And uh, it's it, so far we're we're very happy with uh, saving the seed. We're quite happy with the Shumei method, but we really feel that the health of the soil is carrying the crop. And and we've spent many years growing cover crops and putting all the crop residue in the ground, and this is supplying the energy along with the air, water, and sun. To, uh, to produce good, healthy, high quality crops. You know, we're, we got some really nice, impactful testimonies from the uh, Hong Kong group as to the Jasmine helping with their health. And, and frankly, that that's, can't even be put in monetary value. Uh, as a farmer, I grow a lot of crops on a really large scale and we never hear anything one way or another. We just grow it, it's sent to a cannery, it's sent to a mill, and, and we don't know whether people like it, don't like it, does them good, doesn't do them good. So it's very rewarding for park farming to get some super positive impact from, from the Hong Kong group and, 
We are very uh, thankful that, that the sun and the earth and the water was able to produce a crop that, that could make people feel better. When you're told all these things that you can't grow a crop without chemicals, that we can't feed the world without a bunch of GMO being used to modify crops to supply enough food, that, 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 that that's not true. That, that, that food can improve peer, overall, over all, all the world, and, and Shume Natural Agriculture can be a front runner on, on proving this concept true, and that we don't need to modify, synthesize, everything in food in order to supply the needs of the world. Um, I think it's a, it's a pure concept and it's doable.